everybody, this is Eric Worre, and welcome to NetworkMarketingPro.com. I'm here with my brother from another mother, Cody Bateman, my good friend. He's been around the profession for 23 years. He's the author of MLM Blueprint, which is your subconscious journey to network marketing success. And it's about that topic that I wanted him to uh, come on and, and share some ideas with you, because all of us have some things in our mind that challenge us when it comes to our growth or success. And, and for me, Cody, I think part of it, part of my journey was not necessarily a MLM blueprint, but it was a money blueprint. Mm -hmm. It had to do with um, feeling guilty when you made money. It had to do with, if you ever made money, spending it really fast or giving it away as quick as you could. Um, or just kind of blanking out and going on a binge of uh, going to the mall and buying everything you could buy uh, because the struggle of being without money was actually part of the identity right. of the family, how we grew up, all these different things. So um, talk to me about how this idea of MLM Blueprint came up and, and how people can benefit from at least understanding it. Uh, in order to be able to achieve the, the growth that they want to have. Well, first of all, the idea did come up uh, from the I, from the concept of money blueprints, mm. which you know T. Harv Eker does this big thing on money blueprints, which I really resonated with. Most people resonate with. That's why he's done so well. And I started thinking to myself, well, if if you can create a blueprint in your mind about money, and that blueprint's either propelling you to success or failure with money. Isn't it possible that the same thing can happen in, in multi-level marketing or network marketing? And uh, unquestionably that is the case and it's kind of the same process that's going on. You know, however you created a money blueprint, that money blueprint may have been uh, planted in your subconscious by a parent, by uh, you know, somebody that you cared about, somebody close to you. Same thing with an MLM blueprint. You know, if Uncle John told you when you were 15 years old that you can't make any money in multi-level marketing, don't ever do one of those crazy deals, you may forget that he said that, but your subconscious doesn't forget that he said that. And so 10 years later, when you get involved with an opportunity, you still got that in your head somewhere planted, and it may be blocking you from having success. That's why we did this little project. I'll tell you, for, the, for those of you who are watching, if you feel strange about doing well financially, you have a blueprint issue, you have a subconscious issue. If you ever feel insecure about network marketing at all, even an ounce of insecurity about network marketing, you have a blueprint issue, you have a subconscious mind issue. What most people, how they manifest this is they start by apologizing. They apologize, I'm sorry, I, I know you're busy, I know you're successful, I'm just nothing. And you know, they apologize like crazy. Yeah. They throw out the objections. I know you might not have the time, I know you might not have the money, I know you might not, you know, be a sales, think you're a salesperson or whatever. They throw out all these objections, they project all the negativity that's still stuck in their subconscious mind. Yeah. So one is apologizing, um, two is sabotaging their own business yeah. without even realizing it. They, they, they start a little team, they sabotage the team, and the team gets mad and leaves, or gets discouraged and leaves. Um, what other things happen as a result of a blueprint? Uh, you know, outside of these couple examples, the apologizing and projecting the negativity to the world and the sabotage thing that happens. What else happens? Well, there's, I think there's a lot of things that take place, and it's not, just, it's not just things that have been planted in your mind a long time ago, it's things that are planted in your mind as you're building your business. Mm. So an example of this would be, you know, what happens the first time you get rejected? What happens the first time somebody that's on your team quits your business? These are all key things that happen that I call them shutdowns. What happens when things take place that shut you down mentally in your business and how do you, because a lot of times what happens is, is you might get your mind pretty good and you might start to get pretty confident, but just like any business, and that's a key point, is just like anything you do, you have good days and you have not so good days. And on those not so good days, when somebody quits your business uh, and that's a shutdown, how are you going to respond to it? Because most people in network marketing or in multi-level marketing, 
when those shutdowns take place, they're not prepared for it. And typically when somebody quits your business, an inexperienced person will also quit. In fact, that's the number one reason they do quit. So you have to be prepared for those things. You have to have a good mentor and a coach that's gonna train you. They'll look, you're gonna have these good experiences and you're gonna have these not so good experiences every single day in this business and you gotta be prepared for them. And we talk a lot about those, those and, things. Well, and what I like to say all the time is there's no good experiences really and no bad experiences. It's just learning experiences. That's right. You're gonna learn from both. Yeah. So long as you get better, That's right. as long as you move forward. Once I became unshakable, unstoppable, unmovable in the network marketing profession, then everything got pretty yeah. easy. Um, but until then, wow. And I still deal with self-worth issues. I still deal with, I'm still uncomfortable you know, when I'm introduced to go speak at some conference, I don't feel, I feel like I want to hide when they do that. Yeah. I wish they'd get it over with, yeah, yeah. you know, so I could just go do the, have the conversation with people and, and share some ideas. Um, so I'm still dealing with that. Yeah. I watched Jim Rohn say when he got applause, which made me uncomfortable that he said it. He said, thank you for your applause and I deserve it. <laughs> wow. 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 Yeah. That's a little it bit is. of maturity yeah, it is. there to to recognize, you yeah. know what? He did deserve yeah, it. That's right. Um, so I was like, you know, I'm still struggling to figure out a way to get there, but um, people can get the book if they want to totally dive into this, figure out what what their what created their blueprint that's in place right now. What are the shutdowns and they think that they figure out how to over, overcome things that have happened in their career and may happen in the future, probably will happen in the future. Um, but talk about how you can create a more positive um, MLM blueprint moving forward by exposing yourself to more positive things. Well, there's a lot of things. One of the things I love about what you're doing with Network Marketing Pro is that it's, 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 a, it's a place of positive exposure. And to me, exposure is everything. I talk a lot about that in the book. How, does, how is a blueprint created in the first place? It's created by exposures. You know, the original way that you created blueprints is, you know, you had this actual blue paper and, and bright light would expose an image onto that and that's how they created copies of blueprints. So you create these exposures and you gotta be, you, you gotta get yourself around more positive exposures to our profession. And again, that's what I love about what you do is, is you provide those. You gotta read the good books. You gotta listen to the good tapes. You gotta go to your company events. You have to stay going to those company events. You gotta tap into the weekly conference calls. Those things are get critical. Get around positive people. They're absolutely critical that you do those things. If you don't do those things, you don't make it in this business, period. Mm -hmm. I don't care who you are. You cannot make it in this business without exposing yourself to the right things because the world is gonna expose you to all the bad stuff. Yep. They're gonna expose you to the lies. See, I, I, Eric, I believe that the negativity in the world, those are the lies. The positivity in the world, are, are the, that's the truth. And you have, you, you have a responsibility. It's, 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 it's harder to stay positive than it is to go negative. And you gotta take a responsibility to do that. So when it comes to, to, to recreating a stronger blueprint for MLM success, you have to take responsibility for it. You have to plug yourself into that positivity. And uh, you have to create the affirmations that say, I am successful in my network marketing business. I am a seven, figure income earner in my network marketing business. And not only create the affirmation, but create the daily language that supports that affirmation and keep going to positive things that will reinforce that. And you will absolutely make it. Yeah, I will tell you, for me, it started with audio in my vehicle, driving around. Yeah. I had a lot of drive time, listening over and over to the Jim Rohns of the world or whoever. Um, over and over and over, burning a new groove in my brain, getting rid of the excuses and putting positive stuff in there, turning the radio off, turning the media off. Um, then it was events. That was the second thing. I could plug in and get inspired and get around other people. Then it was the relationships and making sure that even inside your company, there's positive and negative choices you can make when it comes to relationships. Pick the people that are going to lift you up. Right. Uh, but now today we have, you could watch Network Marketing Pro shows unlimited. There's you could watch for weeks and weeks without stopping uh, 1,100 and yeah. some videos that you could just keep watching for just a, a little dose, a little reminder right. that you, know, you could do something 
good here. Or there's other video programs that you can watch and there's a lot of multimedia that you can engage in and, uh, and books, man, books have just totally changed my life. Um, and audio books. I mean, for me, for, for some reason, I'll read a book once, but if there's an audio book that I like, I'll listen to it over and over yeah. and over again and I get the, the value of repetition. Um, so I appreciate you and here's what I would tell everybody, get your hands on this MLM Blueprint book. I think it'll be a really good kind of a tool for you and your organization to inoculate yourself and the people in your group so they have a be better chance for success over the long term. And I appreciate you being an ambassador for the profession for as long as you have and continue to do so. Thanks, brother. All right. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. That's our show. Ladies and gentlemen, my wish for all of you, our wish for all of you, is that you choose to become a network marketing professional. You, you decide to go pro. I should be able to say that after this many times <laughs> because it is a stone cold fact that we have a better way. Uh, Bo Bateman back there thinks that New Orleans is going to meet Denver in the Super Bowl. And who's going to win? And Denver's going to win the Super Bowl this year. Uh, I don't know if I see that. But anyway, that's our show for today. Everybody have a great day. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. As a new skin distributor, you never have to worry about the technology systems that keep your business running. With our innovative IT solutions and secure high-speed data technology, you can focus on your business with the confidence that every minute of every day we are here to ensure your business operates smoothly. Imagine having to calculate sales tax, income tax, and currency conversion on every transaction, all while trying to run your worldwide business. With our global seamless compensation plan, you don't have to. Our systems do the work for you. Our systems gather all new skin transactions from around the world to ensure that every one of your transactions is included in your commission's payment. The order information arrives here at the Global Network Operations Center. The transaction information is processed here and your commission is calculated accurately, including sales tax and currency calculations. Then you receive your commission's payment on time and in your currency.